Sagittarius, welcome to my channel. So today we've got a reading for you singles out there. We're going to take a card surrounding your current energy in your love life. We're going to take a card for what you're after in love, what, you're, uh, what you've learnt from love, a blockage. We'll take um, a card for is your heart ready, is your mind ready, is your spirit ready. We'll clarify those and get a message out there. Hopefully it resonates with plenty. Um, with it being general, it's not going to resonate with everybody else. So do check out your other placements, Moon, Rising, Venus, uh, Descendant, any stellium you might have. For further messages. Okay, Sagittarius. If you want to reach out for a personal reading, you totally can do. It's dis details are in the description box below. And thank you for the likes, shares and subscribes. It uh, helps circulate the videos, gets uh, gets me seen, gets the uh, numbers up. So if you want to, for me to continue doing this, uh, which I love doing, um, I need those numbers up. So if you haven't done so already, please do. It's much, much appreciated. Okay, Sagittarius, what have we got? One more. Right, so, current, ooh, two of them. Current situation, four of pentacles and the ace of swords. Closed off from love because you feel like you never get the truth. Either that or you don't speak from your heart. Truth hurts, I'm hearing. Okay, interesting. Okay, what do you want from love? Eight of cups. You want to walk away from it. Interesting. What have you learned from love? King of Wands. Learn to take the initiative, learn to be confident, stand up for yourself. Interesting. Truth hurts. I keep saying that to me. What's your blockage? The sun. Wow. The sun doesn't always shine. Have you had to? I kind of feel like you have. You've had to bow and grace to somebody in the past. Ah, the true first. Oh, go on. Every Sagittarius is going to be deleting me now. True first. Have you been quite controlling in the past? Or I could, be, I could be talking to a cross-watcher here. Possibly a Leo. With the King of Wands and the Sun here. Because uh, the truth hurts. Is what I keep hearing. And I'm just picturing this kind of horse. Having a bow to somebody type of thing. And lifting it. It's as if, he, if, it's, as if it's lifting its, its leg up to someone to tie your shoelace for you. So I kind of feel like someone's had to do everything for you. Energies can switch. Could be for a cross watch of this, you know. So don't shoot me. Um, but I kind of feel like because it's saying the truth hurts, maybe it is for. However, it fits with you. But I kind of feel like you've um, taken advantage of people, maybe. And maybe they've walked away from that. Or this could have happened to you, and you're working away, walking away from it. You're walking away from that sort of thing that's happened to you. However, it fits. I could. For some of you, you're the one that's done it. For others, it's the other way around. Is your heart ready? Seven of Wands. No, you're defensive now. Yeah, this is your person. Your person's done this to you. Um, uh, Sagittarius, so I apologise for uh, for blaming you for a second there, but this is you now. This is you. Your heart's defensive because of what you've been through. My bad. Sorry. <laughs> please re please resubscribe. <laughs> okay. Um, is your mind ready? The two of cups, yeah. You want your divine counterpart, you want your soulmate. And is your spirit ready? The devil, okay. Capricorn energy, black magic, possibly for some of you. 
Somebody put a spell on you? Just got to chill there. Somebody's put a spell on you. Ace of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck with the King of Cups and the King of Swords. Somebody's put a spell on you. Somebody's put a spell on you, Sagittarius. This person. This um, person that controlled you. There's some sort of black magic surrounding you. Um, but don't panic, because what they're telling me is you're protected. You're protected. It is a narcissist I think you've dealt with. Possibly a water sign. Um, very toxic energy around this. Ooh. So, if this is for, if this is a cross watcher, uh, and you're trying to put some black magic on um, on my Sagittarius here, you can do one because they're protected. You can try all you want. My Sagis are protected. Naughty, naughty, naughty. Some clarifiers. Let's, let's see this. Uh, what this devil is? Definitely black magic. I can feel it. Right. For whoever this resonates with, I want you to go out there. You don't have to spend a lot of money on it. Try and find yourself a spiritual shop and get yourself some sort of tiger's eye or black tourmaline or black. Obsidian. Just carry it with you all the time. Protects you from psychic attacks and black magic. Um, because I just feel very uncomfortable right now. Two more. Four of Pentacles, this of Swords with the Queen of Pentacles. Okay, I've just got a major chill. So, this person that was very controlling in the past, um, it's not them that put the spell on you. It's their mother. And we've got a huge chill. It's their mother. Or at least some sort of maternal figure in their lives. It ain't gonna work. If you're watching this, it ain't gonna work. Eight of Cups, uh, what you want from love with the Ten of Pentacles. Yeah, you're heading, to, you're heading to your Ten of Pentacles. You're protected. You're protected, Sagittarius. Yeah, this person, I'm so uncomfortable. This person um, is not a pleasant person. True furs. What have you learnt? King of Wands with the Hermit. Could be dealing with a Virgo. Um, yeah, you've you learnt to walk away from this controlling nature. You've learnt to look within yourself and trust you. So I kind of feel like they just controlled you. I kind of feel like this is just you going in with yourself and finding you again. Finding your power. Okay, what's blocking you? The Sun with the Two of Wands fire energy again they could both be up to it you know mother and um, your ex-person so I kind of just see two people plotting here they may be at a distance from you and I kind of feel like I did this black magic they're holding this ball I'm kind of pitching like a crystal ball but like um, I almost feel like I don't know what I feel it's not pleasant um, but don't panic, because the, it's futile, it's absolutely futile. Seven of Wands, um, is your heart ready? With the moon. Once this is all going to come out, somehow, I don't know how, all this is going to come out. Um, you, you're going to get the higher ground. Something's going to happen, some sort of... 
I don't know. There's going to be a revelation about something. I'm going to take another card in a minute from another deck just to see if Spirit wants us to know if there's anything specific. I've got a feeling they're just going to show us like a the moon again or something like that where it's going to be different for everybody. But something's going to be... There's going to be a revelation here and all this is going to come to light. Is your mind ready? Two of Cups with the Eight of Wands. Yeah. You, I think you've met somebody. This person's different. This isn't this. Isn't this. You've met somebody. You've met somebody that you've very much fallen in love with and there's still a lot of passion there. Uh, I kind of feel like this is just here to say that everything's going to be okay. Um, this is nothing to do with this. So what this what they're kind of telling me is just you protected. I kind of feel like this is kind of constantly saying you protected. Okay, the devil is your spirit ready with the page of wands. Okay, yeah, um, right. They're kind of saying to me like. When, this is why I said that you're protected. You know, they're trying this black magic, um, and they're kind of just saying they're amateurs. <laughs> you know, the pages are young, they're amateurs, they're not going to touch you. You're protected. Your angels are fighting for you. Angels are fighting for you. Bottom of the deck, Six of Cups, and I think this is saying Six of Cups with a Nine of Wands. It's a past person, yeah. Nine of Wands, yeah, you're protected. Massively protected. I kind of feel like your angels are fighting for you here. Um, but it also says to me that the Six of Cups, uh, with this Two of Cups here that you're going to be con connecting with, um, it's just giving you that hope for the future. Y you're going to find your, your soulmate. Right. Seven of Wands with the Moon. Let's have a look at this. Can we get a card for the Seven of Wands and the Moon? What's this revelation? Do we have anything, any information for Sagittarius? The Strength card, they're just saying that you've, that you're protected. And so, at Leo Energy again. Did I say Leo earlier? Yeah, there's Leo Energy all over this. So you could have been dealing with Leo in the past. Nine of Cups, the Magician. You're gonna get your wish fulfillment because you manifested it. Brilliant. Uh, yeah, so they're not they're not giving me too many details about what's coming out. They're just basically saying, "Don't worry, you know we've got you covered. You're protected. You know the lion, the lion's the protector." Um. There you go, Sagittarius. Um. They can try all they want. They're not gonna. They're not gonna. You may have had. You may feel like it's worked. You may have had a bit of a bad patch. You may feel like you have been cursed or something, but it just trust me. It's not words. Your angels are str your angels are stronger. It's kind of the message. Okay. <laughs> Let me know if it resonates. Uh, strong Leo energy, Virgo, Capricorn, um, Pisces, Cancer. Uh, but we've got swords. We've got pentacles. We've got uh, cups, and we've got wands. So everybody's here. Those are your standouts, though. Let me know if it resonates, and uh, you know, don't worry, you're protected. Okay, take care. Thank you for like, shares, and subscribes, and I'll see you next time. Cheers. Bye.